vessel sealing, you first need to plug the foot switch into the back of the vet seal unit. Ensure that you plug this into the socket labeled vessel sealing and not bipolar. Next you need to take the adapter included with your handpiece and plug this into the sealing section on the front of the vet seal. Once you have plugged this in, you will notice that the light for ThermoCut 5 or ThermoCut 10 will automatically light up, depending on which handpiece you will be using. Now take your handpiece cable. Plug one end into the adapter and the other into the handpiece. You can now adjust the power by pressing the plus button. You can choose between low, medium or high power. You are now ready to begin vessel sealing. We will now set up the 5mm handpiece. First, take the 5mm adapter. Plug this into the sealing port on the front of the vet seal. You will notice that this time, ThermoCut 5 will be automatically selected. Now take your 5mm handpiece cable. Plug one end into the adapter and the other into the handpiece. Like before, you can now set your power level with the plus button. You are now ready to seal with your 5mm handpiece. We will now go through the bipolar setup on the VET seal 2. First, plug the foot switch into the bipolar socket in the back of the VET seal. We will now be using the bipolar panel on the front of the VET seal. You can set the coag power using the plus and minus buttons. As we are using a foot switch, we need to ensure that the VET seal is not set to auto. You can select this using the button here. Now take your bipolar cable and plug into the bipolar socket as shown. Plug the other end of the cable into the bipolar forceps. This is now ready to use. Next we will go through the monopolar setup. First, you will need to plug in your REM plate into the VET seal. Once plugged in correctly, you will notice the REM plate indicator light will turn green. You can now plug in your monopolar handpiece into the monopolar socket. For cutting, you will need to set the VET seal to Pure, Blend 1, or Blend 2 mode. You can scroll through the different modes by pressing the Select button. Now set the correct power using the plus and minus buttons and you are ready to begin cutting. For coag you will need to set the vet seal to soft or desiccate mode by pressing the select button. Now set your coag power with the corresponding plus and minus buttons and you are ready to begin.